Hi, I'm Mr. Simons, and in this video, I want to do two things. I want to wish those students starting the 2021 HSC this week the very best of luck, and then I want to thank everyone for watching my videos and commenting and being part of the tiny community this year. So this has been a very challenging, chaotic and frustrating year for students and teachers, but mostly for students. So many things have been uncertain and cancelled. There has been a lot of questions and not a lot of answers. There has been a lot of waiting and now we are here in terms of the exams. I wish you the very best of luck. It's not an easy situation to be sitting down to do these exams in. So in terms of approaching the exams, when you are there in the exam room, annotate like crazy. Underline things, highlight, circle, use your arrows, do whatever you can to try and understand the parameters of the question and what you need in your answer before you start writing the answer. That would be really valuable. The other thing that I would suggest is to make sure that you explain your concepts fully. So what I mean by that is that my starting point is often thinking about, okay, the markers know nothing. Now they definitely do know a lot, but in terms of showing your knowledge, you need to start from a place where you don't assume that the markers know anything. And then what you're going to do is you're going to provide the definitions, the explanation, and then clear links between the concept and the question. That's what I would try and do in terms of the longer short answers and in terms of my essays. I really need to set it up in terms of showing the marker, yes, I know the content. Yes, I can explain the content. And then yes, I can link it back to the question and make my answer highly relevant. Okay, and now to the second part of the video. I just wanted to thank everyone who has watched my videos, commented on my videos, or shared my videos with someone else. That it's been a year of really large growth in terms of the number of viewers and also the number of hours watched as well, which is really excellent for me because my goal is to try and make economics and now business studies a little easier and a little more enjoyable and engaging for students so that the more people that know about my content and watch the videos, that the more I can work towards trying to achieve that goal. So I'm really appreciative of everyone who has watched things on my channel. Now, in terms of my request from you, it's the same request I make uh, this time every year. And what it is, is that if my videos have been useful to you in any way, please let someone else know about them. If you have a friend that is about to start Echo or Business in year 11, or someone who is going into year 12 and could benefit from watching some of the videos that I've created, please do tell them. That's gonna help me achieve my goal of getting my content out to as many students as possible and of helping as many students as I can. In terms of the channel, I'm gonna just take a little bit of a break until 2022. I might post the odd video here and there before the end of the year, but not the kind of weekly or twice weekly um, posting schedule that I have had lately. So a few things that I've got in the works for next year, which I'm very excited to be able to share with you at that point, but for now, just kind of step back, take stock, maybe do a little prep for next year. So if you're about to start the HSC, good luck. The very best of luck to you. I hope the exams go smoothly and that you achieve the results that you set out to. And to everyone who has been watching my channel, not just the HSC students, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. It's quite amazing to see the little community that we've got going at the moment. Anyway, that's kind of everything that I wanted to say. So I will see you in the next one.